Jot those little phrases down. Should, could, don't. Here's what we call that. Formula for disaster. And all you've got to do to start now the process of life change is start somewhere. And it doesn't even matter where. You can start with good health or you can start with something else. The key is to start by saying, I'm going to start the process in each category of finding by my own research. And that's why seminars are so valuable. That's why information is so valuable. That's why somebody willing to take the time to share is so valuable, is to help boil it down in some form to the half a dozen few things that takes care of most of it. And then let me get on with practicing it. And where you start doesn't matter. The process of life change can start with as simple a process as an apple a day, which means I'm on the road to cleaning up neglect. I'm going to walk around the block. I'm going to get the next book of my new library. I'm going to get a journal. Shove taught me to keep a journal. He said, don't just let ideas get by you. Don't trust your memory. If you're serious about really becoming an entrepreneur, if you're serious about affecting other people's lives, if you're serious about fortune, if you're serious about wealth and health, if you're serious, start collecting ideas. Go over them and review them. Then make them a part of your life and practice and don't ever look back. That formula helped change my life brought me to where I am today. And I'm so delighted now to have the opportunity to go around the world telling the same story that I heard when I was 25 years old. There's a few basic things, and if you practice them every day, I'm telling you, there's no reason why you can't have the health you want, the relationship you want, the fortune you want, the money you want, the income you want, the sophistication you want, the culture you want, the prestige you want, the influence you want, all of it. It's wrapped up, I think, in a nutshell of what I've just explained to you. A few things. Now, let me give you one more part of it. Here it is. Once you've found the few things that makes the most difference, now spend most of your time working on those few things. That now is another part of the clue. The first part of the clue is to get the information and consistently practice it. But here's the rest of the formula. Spend most of your time on it. The reason why a lot of people don't do that well is because they major in minor things. They spend too much time on things that don't count much. And they spend too little time on things that would count. So jot this formula down. If the equation is wrong, the results can be disastrous. If the equation is wrong, the results can be disastrous over a given period of time. Here's a guy in the last 10 years who's bought 2,000 donuts and two books. And this guy says, you know, my life isn't working well. Well, anybody in this audience could give him a seminar, right? Once we knew these numbers, here's what we might suggest to this guy. Hey, this may be one of your major problems. In the last 10 years, you've spent too much money on donuts and not enough money on books. You've spent too much money feeding the body and not enough money gathering food for the mind. And it's not the miracle of your body that works out your future. It's the miracle of your mind. But if you nourish the body and neglect to nourish the mind, I'm telling you, you're going to have all kinds of problems and all kinds of difficulties. So we would suggest, one of our suggestions in our seminar to this man would be, in the next 10 years, spend a lot less money on donuts and a lot more money on books. Food for... Thought, bread for the head, we call it. I mean, you got to have ideas that feed your mind, not just your body. And the miracle of the mind is so fabulous to work out your future, to give you all the equities you could possibly hope for, to give you every dream and every treasure you could possibly want for you and your family and the people you care most about. It's all available. But it is a very basic, simple process. Once you've found the few things, spend most of your time and money working on those few things.